the rest next to her grandfather. Homeless man Henry Hammond has been charged with her murder. Australians have been caught up in a nightmare in Venice as an out-of-control cruise ship rammed into a busy dock. The collision left passengers panicked and injured. A colossus of modern tourism pummeling into an ancient city. The blast of a horn, the only warning, a cruise ship was out of control. No. Those on land ran for their lives as a smaller river cruiser was flung aside. Hold on. Hold on. Then the looming luxury liner, nearly three football fields long, <laughs> slammed into the Venice dock with unimaginable force. Australian tourists on board capturing the moment. <laughs> Robert Loretti filming this video. When they sounded the horn, um, that's when all hell broke loose. People were running everywhere. Uh, people screaming on the pier, people screaming on the boat, uh, jumping, doing everything they could to get out of the way. The catastrophe unfolding in slow motion. It was extremely slow. That's, it was surreal which is why it was so hard to take in. The cause of the incident is still unclear. The ship's owner blaming a mechanical problem. The ship's passengers are now stranded in the city they came to see. Other vessels will be made available for those willing to cruise again. No. My wife took 20 years to get me on a cruise, and this is the first cruise that we've ever been on together, and 20 hours in, this happens. Amelia Brace, 7 News. <laughs> Scott Morrison has pledged a quarter of a billion dollars in funding for the Solomon Islands mm. in his first trip overseas 